Building trade and technological ties was at the top of the agenda as Prime Minister Modi landed in the capital of Brunei. Mr. Modi toured the Omar Ali Saifuddin Mosque in Brunei's capital. He also inaugurated a new building at India's High Commission. This is part of a two-nation tour this week which will also take him to Singapore. A Russian missile strike killed more than 50 people and injured scores of others on Tuesday. Ukrainian officials said the latest in a series of devastating bombardments of Ukraine and one of the deadliest attacks of the two-and-a-half-year war. Mongolia's failure to arrest Vladimir Putin on an international criminal court warrant dealt a heavy blow to the international criminal law system. Ukraine's foreign ministry has said as the Russian president arrived for talks, likely to focus on a new gas pipeline connecting Russia and China. The US Justice Department charged several Hamas leaders, including the group's head, Yahya Sinwar, in connection with kidnapping and murdering American citizens during the October 7th attack in Israel. This, as the UK's decision to suspend some arms sales to Israel has caused a diplomatic row with the country as the Israeli PM denounced the move as shameful. Meanwhile, China kicks off a major African summit.